Alamar, okay? He, he doesn't want to aim. He doesn't want to test out yeah. any characters against no, Steve. He's no. like, let me beat this Steve. No mercy. Yeah. Oh, and actually, Olimar versus Steve is... Olimar is the only character, like, that I think can out-camp Steve because he can just get four purples. <laughs> yes, even even though there's a max of three. <laughs> or, yeah, you know what I'm saying. And right there, we're already seeing first purple out. And interesting, we saw uh, D Dog obviously like do that thing with Steve where he just put up a wall, and the bus fared it and it instantly crumbled. The bus yeah. definitely knows this matchup. Like you can just tell off the bat, he knows what to do against Steve. I think that was the yellow fair too, so it got get rid of more of the blocks. One thing I feel like is scary is um. I feel like Steve can kind of like melt through the Pikmin if you like throw like a Pikmin at him. Like he can like, I feel like the fair is like so crunchy. And, yeah, like, and that minecart as you saw yeah. right there. But that 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 white putting it in work. And I was just gonna fair that again, yeah. And once you fair it, most characters, you know, even after destroying, would have to run in. But the Buzz has the ability to just destroy the wall and then stay safe by throwing Pikmin, you know. Mm. So um, interesting stuff. Oh, and so good at catching that uh, that um cart. Choosing to hold on to that purple there, though. I think he wants to hold on to that one for killing, obviously. D Dog taking his own time with things, sitting on the other side of the stage. DeBuzz uh, reloading his lineup. Yeah, this is nice. I mean, I feel like you can very realistically have double purple Everest every stock. Yeah. Right now, oh, it instantly dies to the minecart. Mine That's so tragic. Yeah, I think the minecart is like the Pikmin, like, eviscerating. <laughs> yeah. D Dog going to be able to get diamonds at least. But now he does have uh, the the diamond, yeah, as you said, and diamond hit lag plus a pit plus a Pikmin, like it's crazy. Active. Oh, oh my god, as you saw the yeah, it's crazy active. <laughs> yeah, it, it, it's like Steve's aerials just have a special way of like just totally like just crunching through everything. Yeah, bro, I would not want to be a Pikmin right now. <laughs> <laughs> These purples are terrified for yeah. their life. <laughs> Yeah, and I wonder if the diamond can just, I feel like very likely, yeah, we'll just definitely destroy a purple with like one swing. Like any diamond aerial, I think we'll just kill a purple. To Buzz sitting back at like the center of the stage, really respecting uh, D Dog's burst range with like dash attack or dash grab maybe. Yeah, I feel like he wants to constantly be at a space where he can react to minecart. I feel like that's his biggest game plan. Yeah. Because that's like the bi best way for D Dog to shut down Pikmin. Yeah, you notice every single time he does a he does like a fair, he like instantly tries to retreat or like side B or something. Oh, here it is, the three purples. Triple purple, baby. Oh, oh. two purples tragically died yeah. in a bombing. That was actually so sad. I know DeBuzz is sad about that. He, sp he, he, he spent so long trying to get them. Yeah. Rebuilding, though. I wonder yeah. how many Pikmin have died this time. <laughs> like, there's been so many. Oh, and D Dog getting that lucky break right there with grab from DeBuzz. Yeah, you I don't see that very him. often. I respect, I feel like DeBuzz hasn't grabbed besides, like, the start of the game getting like an early percent combo, so I totally understand why DeBuzz went for that grab, but D Dog, smart roll. I think a Pikmin, or I'm not sure, but a Pikmin might have gotten caught during his up air string, up tilt string, so I think that's why D Dog dropped that combo. I could play a factor, you know, even if it just throws off your timing a little, it could be the difference maker between like taking like 25 or like 60. Okay, the Solomar combos that drag down there into up tilt. Oh, good on to bust, recognize that D Dog actually did not have a jump there. And this is like, I mean, the buzz just. Okay, I was yeah. gonna say, just dominating D Dog just constantly was at a space where he was. So Buzz was totally out of the range of all of Steve's aerials. Mm -hmm. D Dog only really could burst with that side B, and he, I feel like the Buzz never got like comboed off the side B once. Like I, yeah. he might have been like hit by one stray one, but he's been punishing it over and over. D Dog just didn't know what to do, honestly. Mm -hmm. If you're good at dealing with that move on Wi-Fi, which I know the Buzz has played a lot of, then you're not gonna get hit by many offline. Yeah, I feel like he's showing the weaknesses of Steve. I feel like this uh this game yeah. like it's all it's Steve sometimes can feel so insanely broken when he's like running you over and just like totally pressing whatever button he wants, but I feel like Olimar is a character that can exploit the fact that Steve is slow. <laughs> he's not yeah. gonna he's not gonna really like run up on you. Mm -hmm. Sitting in the middle, just like throwing those Pikmin like really messes with his game plan because he, he's getting materials but he's also taking a lot of damage. Like right now. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, and that's the thing is too, Steve has the worst jump in the game. And so, especially when DeBuzz has purple right there, like the best way to really get around Olimar throwing Pikmin out is jumping over the throw. And but, approaching at that like 45 degree angle, yeah, right? But, yeah, Steve but Steve cannot do that. Steve cannot do that. In fact, Steve's jump can probably get stuffed out and what? Please just, don't tell me that was true. You just zeroed to death. I don't think so, but okay. you just zeroed to death D-Dog. You just zeroed to death Steve. That, yeah. That's a task. To not get hit by a single like Wait, straight he has got, up Okay, okay, yeah. okay. Good, good on D-Dog. 
Oh, now. that's very dangerous. Oh, oh thank God, God that that white fell off. That could have been really bad. But he's still like <laughs> eight seventy. Still at seventy percent. He could have been at like a hundred. I feel like D Dog's just like saying like screw it. I'm just gonna start swinging. Yeah. Like I'm down so much. And I feel like Dabas is knowing that and doing the same thing. I mean, I don't blame him for like trying something new. I mean, like his like the whole game plan of just sitting back like really wasn't working before because the buzz was just poking at him with uh, the Pikmin. Oh, that's and usually that can like catch a spot dodge like that, but yeah, barely. I mean, still dominantly double purple now. Double purple and, and a white. Yeah. I'd be terrified. <laughs> oh, nah, not gonna be enough. Very that that wood fair is pretty weak. Oh no, are the purples gonna die? Okay. Wow. Narrowly avoiding the explosion. Yeah. I feel like that was a turnaround up smash. But, but maybe my Olimar is built different. I think he didn't up smash there because he whiffed up smash, right? Yeah. yeah. Yeah, I think the up smash might have traded with the magma block. Maybe. Maybe. I don't know. Oh, Can't... both of them died. Oh, wow. Because of the so much hit lag that it hits the it hits the buzz to the point where the Pikmin then can be hit. They aren't like invincible anymore. And then it's so laggy that it stays out. That's really good against Olimar, but we haven't been able to see that because the post strip has not been getting hit much. Yeah. D Dog Fair kind of put in work here. He read that jump earlier to take that stock before. And I feel like, yeah, that's how. I feel like D Dog is figuring out how he's supposed to play right now and that you just shouldn't camp as much as normal. I think we've only seen wooden and diamond tools so far. Like, <laughs> or maybe it's because the stage we're playing on. Like, he straight up cannot get that much iron. Yeah. Um, definitely this this game pretty much no iron. Yeah. And when he does get iron, I feel like he instantly mine cards. Yeah, 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 yeah. Oh, and yeah, that's oh, so geez. strong. <laughs> that's so nice in the matchup to just totally melt the Pikmin. Are you dead? Wow. Oh my god. Doesn't that move has? I'm pretty sure it has a sour spot at the start, then it gets stronger, like mm -hmm. the longer it's and out maybe. I don't know. I don't know if you noticed, D-Dog just refreshed yeah. his diamond tools. That was really good from D-Dog too, because he set the minecart to the left, but then he like did like the B-reverse thing or whatever, and he turned around to get the back air. Type an exploration point, Macharino, if you believe in the D-Dog 3-stock comeback. Yeah. I need to see it. Okay. This is scary. <laughs> like, yeah. you really this only is, need this one. Is, this is scarily possible. This rage on Steve right now and yeah. Olimar. Okay. Oh, no, that's it. <laughs> he exploded. Yeah. Still, the D-Dog, I feel like, did fig Like, he showed, like, that he's a strong player because he figured out what he needed to do. Even though it was a bit too late, he figured out he cannot play the same put up a wall, camp, Steve, mind game. Yeah. He figured out he had to, like, use Steve's aerials, which are good. Mm -hmm. He had to use them way more. He had to, like, stop Olimar from getting the Pikmin momentum going. Yeah. So. And even if he doesn't hit Olimar, he's, like, hitting, like, all three Pikmin at once mm -hmm. and just, like, eviscerating them. Yeah, and so active, it puts up a wall. Yeah. But that was really good stuff. Glad we got to see DeBuzz. Definitely gonna see more of him, hopefully the Sora. We'll see. I feel like he did not want to risk anything against Steve. Probably not a fan of that character. Yep. But that is gonna be it. Actually, you don't know, oh, it's DeBuzz. Are we gonna swap, right? I, I don't think so, not oh, yet. we're not swapping yet.